So, so, so do you think 2025 is the year we see Tank against T.O. or Shakur or, or, or that caliber? Yeah, everybody run. Hey, I'm gonna judge you. I know right now everybody everybody running away from T.O. I tell you that ain't nobody ain't nobody trying to fight T.O. There will be people who want me to who, who want right. me to ask you about the banana comments and all that. That's 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 uh oh shoot you know what you, I'll take that back. You know who wanted to fight him? Um, I think it was Shakur. I think Shakur wanted to fight him, and he said Deshaun no. Does and he said no. Shakur wanted to fight him. He said no. Yeah, or, or, was I, I that that. or was that Keyshawn? Or was it both of them? It was Keyshawn too. It was Keyshawn too. Okay. So like when, when when people when everybody running around saying that nobody wants to fight him, you know what? Uh, you know, nah, motherfuckers want to fight him, but he don't want to fight them. It's crazy. You know, To To is the type of guy that wants to. He wants to just go straight to the top. He ain't one of those guys that like to fool around. Like if you ain't like bringing something something to the table, you know, like for instance, like he chasing Terrence. Terrence Crawford and everybody's giving him a hard time about chasing Terrence Crawford, and they're saying, "Well, he he can't move up to the weight classes. Why can't he?" Crawford trying to fight Canelo. That's two weight classes up, right? Some will even say three weight classes. So, like, what? You know what I mean? Like, guys are jumping around different weight classes now. Tao can go up to fifty four and face the Terrence Crawford. You know. So, anyways, uh. Yeah, all that, all that. Look, I'm going to just put it this way, man. Everybody sitting up here. Still, I, I just can't believe that, like, we as black people, I'm talking black people. We're still, we're still stuck. I don't get it. Why are we still giving this type of shit energy? Like, I don't understand that, man. Why are we giving this type of energy to certain words? You get these words. These words are always going to be powerful if you give this shit energy. You know, I've learned over the years, over my years, bro, people going to say whatever the fuck they want to say. They going to say whatever they want to say. It's the First Amendment, to be honest with you. You can say whatever. You you could be able to say whatever, or you should be able to say whatever the hell you want to say. The First Amendment, however, they need to change that because that's not necessarily true. You know, do I agree with what Tao said? No, I don't agree. But if you put any kind of energy into that type of talk, then you give it power. And that's the reason why we're talking about it right now is because you're giving it power, bro. I look at that and I just go, bruh, dude, you're ignorant. That's plain and simple. You're ignorant. You think you're funny. You're ignorant. I've heard this word many times. I've heard the word hard R many times in my life too. Many times from different people. Still here today. I hear coon all the time. I hear Uncle Th I hear all these dumbass words that people use. And it don't affect me because I don't put no energy into it. I go, I heard this shit before. I heard it before. Say it louder. Because I know who I am. That's the difference. I know who I am. I know what I'm about. You can say and you can think whatever you want to think. You're not in my day-to-day -day circle. I don't give a damn what you say or think of me. It doesn't matter. So... What Tao said, if Tao would have said it to me, I, I'd have been, I would have laughed it off. I'd have been like, man, you're ignorant. You're dumb. You know, you're a dumb little kid. You're looking for attention. Go play on your playground, you know. That's what I would have said. I would. I, I don't take that shit into any consideration. I don't, man. Because you sit back and you say, well, he's racist and this and that. Dude, I've been called racist. You know how many times I've been called racist, bro? I've been taught, oh, you're racist against black people. You're racist against this race. You're racist against that race. I hear that on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm like, dude, my wife is lying. Come with something different. You know? My dad's black. My cousins are black. Like, come on. Bring something different, man. You know, because I've heard that before. So, anyways, um, yeah. I don't take the, the, the racist quote unquote comments and all that, dude, I don't give it no energy. And I teach my kids the same thing. 
the same exact thing because people are going to say what they want to say. They are. Get that through your mind and 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 be honest with be honest with yourself. Everybody's a little racist about something. Be honest. We are. Everybody. It don't matter because everything is contributed to our life experience and what we've gone through. Some people can say things just out of spite and just want to be disrespectful. There's others that have lived through things that has turned them a certain way. You know, so what T.O. said, I don't agree with. However, he fucking said it. Who gives a fuck? I don't. I don't care what he says. Even if he said it to me. Doesn't bother me not one bit because I know who I am. And it's just words. Has no effect over me. So that, that's all that's all I'm gonna say, man. You yeah. know, yeah. I know I'm gonna get ridiculed. Some people might oh disagree, this this dude. I'm not soft. I'm sorry. I'm not soft. I'm not gonna buy into the bull crap. I, I really ain't. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I, I don't know where to go from there, but uh, no, no, no. Yeah. I just look at things differently, man. I teach my kids this. Yeah, I got young yeah. girls. I got young women, man, that, that I'm raising. You know, with my wife. I got my son. You know, my young youngest son that I'm raising. You know what I'm saying? Like they mixed. They hear shit all the time at school. You Both know what sides. I'm saying? And they go and they go to, you know, predominantly, you know, uh, Caucasian and, and Hispanic schools. So they get it from both ends mm-hmm. on, a, on a day-to-day basis, you know? And so if they get called, if they get called some sort of racial slur, they don't pay no mind and no attention to it. And guess what? People stop saying. It. People stop. People tell them, yeah, they ain't going to get nowhere. They ain't going to get you nowhere. Because my daughters, my daughters know what time it is. My daughters, they'd be like, ha, huh, heard that before. Oh, yep, yeah, say it louder. Say it louder so everybody can hear you. And, and guess what? What happens? They don't say it. They don't say it at all. And so they're completely immune to the word because it's going to get used. I hear people use it all the time. I hear all the young folks using the N-word all the time. All this whole generation using the N-word. It don't matter what race, what color you are. <laughs> everybody's using the word. Seriously. I, I know. And I, I hear up, it. I grew up seeing it. All races saying it. Yes. <laughs> and you want to know something? There's some people that grow up in urban areas, bro. Yes. That are white, complected, Mexican, yada yada yada. They've been going to school with 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 black folks, kids. You know what I mean? And they they pick up the word. They I've live in it. The, they live. They live in the gutter. They live in the hood. They live. That's you know what I mean. That's their reality. And so they use the word. So. Some people like, call it, they have the pass, whatever, you know? Yeah. They, look, hey, I'm, I'm not, I'm not giving it. I'm not giving that word any more energy, bro. It's like, it's whatever, you know, the last time I, I, I somebody called me the hard R word, and you know what I told them? I said, I'm a damn good one. And they looked at me sideways like, what? Huh? I said, yeah, I'm a damn good one, too. Hell yeah. And the, the, no rebuttal. Because what do you say to that? What do you say to that? I know what I am. <laughs> you can think whatever you want to think. Say whatever you want to say. But I know what I am, and I know who I am. And I know I'm not that. Am I, you remember uh, "Don't be a menace to South Central" and this message is that is that kind of what you just broke down? You know, I'm trying to make trying to. No, bring I'm just trying to get to people. To, I'm just trying to get people to understand, yeah. man, that you know this is this is a higher way of thinking, bro. This is a different way of thinking, and and some will agree, and some and some won't. You know, Tim, you can't let nobody disrespect you, like, and it's that it, 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 these a lot of these people they're just they're irrelevant, man. They're irrelevant. We 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 pay so much attention to irrelevant people in your life. We waste so much time, you know, arguing and bickering people that are irrelevant in your life, man. Period. 
And and I'm not going to stoop to their level. There's no point in it. You're not going to get anywhere. They are, they're already showing their ignorance right out the gate if they're speaking in that fashion, especially in 2024. Yeah. Hello? I don't want to be around you. I don't want to. It just makes you look there. like the asshole that you are for talking that way. Like anybody yeah. with a brain isn't going to fuck with you after you reveal that, you know? So, yeah. 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 So, you know, look, if, if, if I've been called milk dud, shit, uh, they call me milk dud because of my head. I got a big ass head. I do. I know I do. I got a big, look at this big ass dog. This mother, I thank my mom every single day. Thank you, mama. Shoot, I know I'm almost. I got, I got a big head too, Tim. If it makes you feel but, better, yeah, all this hair but, covers it, but I, I got a big head too. So, but it doesn't bother. You see, but it doesn't bother me, you know, because you know, one is real. Yes, I know. You know, what I mean, so I, I do got a big ass head. It's the way I was born. You big know, brain. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing I can do to change it. So, but that's just the way I think, man. And and. I just wish that others would, 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 would think in similar fashion because then they can live freely. You know what I mean? They can live freely and, and, and without holding grudges and, 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 you know, being, you know, racist and, and all this shit. Like, bro, like, I ain't got a racist bone in my body, bro. I really don't. I, I don't. So um, I respect everybody. I, I treat people how I, I want to be treated in a way if I need to get step out of line and, and, and become, you know, something that I'm not, I can do that too. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? I, I, I can get ignorant. I can sure can. But I try to refrain from that, man, as much as possible. And I try not to stoop to the, the levels of, of people that you're dealing with, because trust me, man, it's, it's only going to turn into violence. So, um, but anyways, T.O., you got to think, man, you got to think before you talk. And that's just it. Think before you say, you know, yes, you got a freedom of speech. You thought the shit was cute. You thought it was funny. However, you offended some people. I get that. But me, you ain't offend me at all. Even if you said it to me, I would laugh at you. Shit. I would literally laugh at you and say, you stupid, bro. You, you, you dumb as hell. Well, man, hey, thank you. Thank you for, uh, it's not even something I was, like, anxious to talk about. It's just once Tio's name came up, I'm like, oh, well, they're, you know, the fans will be upset at me if I don't ask Tim about that recent comment and everything. So, appreciate you even getting on the topic and, you know, yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm just sharing, sharing my thoughts on it as far as how I deal with that type of stuff, man, on a day-to-day -day basis, you know. Um, some days are more than others, but for the most part, bro, doesn't bother me at all, man. Um, last time I checked, money is green, right? Still green. Yes. That's it. That's what I'm that, and that's what and that's what I'm after. Dang, I just hit a dang what's the name? Oh my tumbleweed. Just murdered. It's murdered the front end of my car. Was that because uh I distracted you a little bit with the interview, or was nah, that gonna happen nah. anyway? Nah, nah. I try to, I try to break a little bit, to let it clear, but it did. It stopped. <laughs> like, nope, this is gonna happen. So I think it's in front of my car. But anyways, yeah, man. Um, but uh, yeah, man. Um, I'm looking forward to, I'm looking forward to the fight this weekend. Um,